Hi, we're at Gap Tech Incorporated. Today we're going to take about two minutes and we're going to get rid of this old style flash suppressor. And that's just a matter of backing this off. And we're going to put in its place a Gap Tech flash hider system that will have a host of features that are much better than what you have. Now if you've got a, a lock washer or a set of shims or a crush washer, you can leave it right there. Now this is one of several models of GATTAC flash hider system, flash hider units. It comes with a with a GT1 adapter and three styles of, 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 of flash hider. And that GT1 adapter goes right back on those half 28 threads. Now it's time to put maybe a drop of blue Loctite on there. Run that up. Get a good open end wrench, no adjustable wrenches here, and you snug that up. Then you take whichever of the three styles of flash hider units you have and you run that on there, right down there. Snug it up with a simple tool. Can be the shank of a Phillips head screwdriver, can be an Allen wrench, and you've got a, a component there that will give you a felt reduction in recoil. It will actually diffuse the flash. It's cosmetically appealing. It has no adapter thread showing out here on the outside of the unit. And you only have to put the GT1 adapter on there one time ever. That's all you have to do. When you're done shooting, you want to clean your gun. You back that off. And you get your inexpensive oil filter you're going to clean breach to muzzle that's the right way to do it so you clean your gun when you're done this comes back off here goes on your bench for your next session and in any of the any of the three styles of that tack flash harder system components will screw right onto there you've got choices there also snug it up with a simple tool and you are good to go that's gat tack flash harder systems you can look us up at flashstealth.com.